friends i am sonali bhatia from creative edge and i welcome you to the grand learning festival by top rankers where we celebrate the beautiful journey of learning i hope aapne pichle 4 din mein kafi sare events mein participate kiya hoga ye un events mein se ek aur kadi hai jahan hum aapko kuch insights of the industry leke aana cha rahe hain we have a very uh, experienced and renowned faculty with us the expert faculty that is going to give you insights of her understanding her learning from the world of design i would like to uh, introduce you to miss ambika magotra who is an nid alumni with an extensive teaching experience of 20 years in top design colleges she is also a recipient of international award for her paper publication presentation at iwfti also ek bahut एक्साइटिंग चीज है जब भी आप नेक्स्ट इंटरनेशनल ट्रेवल करें प्लीज लुक फॉर द इमिग्रेशन ऑफिसर यूनिफॉर्म एट ऑल इंडियन इंटरनेशनल एयरपोर्ट दे आर डिजाइन बाय आर एक्सपर्ट फैकल्टी टूडे मिस अंबिका मगोत्रा वी वेलकम यू टू द स्टूडियो मैम थैंक यू सो मच लवली टू बी हेयर मैम बिफोर लूजिंग मोर टाइम I would like to tell you, ma'am, that we get a lot of questions about our uh, design industry, a lot of questions about creative inclination, a lot of career uh, doubts and queries that I would like to put forward to you today, and try and see if we can satisfy, motivate, and encourage students to get into such a beautiful, colorful industry that you are from. So let me begin with your journey as a designer. so to start with what inspired you to become a designer so if you can share your journey i am sure it will be very helpful and motivating for our students sure so uh, my journey as a designer started in my history classes actually so i really owe to my history teachers who were teaching it so beautifully that the way they used to speak and tell about the stories you know i was always so curious to know how did our royalties dressed up so i think jab lagan film mai to usse pehle hi i was kind of dreaming about such things you know like how do we recreate that aura so it was done in that film so beautifully and um, then i was a very good illustrator my bio uh, diagrams were really nice so uh, during that time design i mean i'm from very ancient times uh, so teachers used to appreciate that you know you're doing very good and i used to get good as like you had to have that as a good element and coming from a doctor's family you know it was a little task that uh, ek to d for design kuch malum hi nahi tha us time pe so yes i knew that i'm very creative and storytelling was automatically coming into my personality through history you know so a combination of history and bio was something which was quite exciting and uh, i think uh, later on uh, i come from a very small town so i had no idea about there is this world of design existing i was introduced to this world uh, by my parents and an art teacher later on you know like when we were in that crossroads what uh, discipline to take that's the time when i got into it and i also was learning as a kid you know how to crochet how to make clothes from my grandmother so i have literally played with dolls like anything so i used to dress them up and all that that's i think a very cliched story but yes i have lived my dreams making outfits for the dolls this is very inspiring to hear all that ma'am because uh, once the students come to us they have similar inclinations right there is no but no one with excellent design or sketching ability bahut baar bacche ye poochte hain ki hame drawing nahi aata बट हमें डिजाइन फील्ड अच्छी लगती है हमें कुछ क्रिएट करना अच्छा लगता है तो आपने जैसे बताया कि आपको क्रोशे पसंद आता था यू यूज यू अ वेरी गुड बायो स्टूडेंट और मे बी हिस्ट्री इंक्लिनेशन के कारण आपको वो एरा क्रिएट करना अच्छा लगता था सो आई वुड रियली लाइक टू पॉइंट दिस आउट टू दिस चिल्ड्रेन दैट सी कोई भी एक स्पेसिफिक स्किल सेट होना रिक्वायर्ड नहीं है दीज आर ऑल इंक्लिनेशन पॉइंट दैट यू नीड टू रियलाइज दैट आर driving you towards this innovative and creative field so you all have to just keep your eyes open to see this inclination these small clues where you can find out are you really made for this industry or not taking that forward ma'am like you said that you had this from your schools and you uh, come from an era where it was not much talked about we are fortunate enough now that parents are quite 
open minded students are more aware about these industries still there are students and parents who are still um, um, bogged up in the mindset of doing engineering medical or uh, maybe cscs so uh, what would you like to uh, send a message what kind of a message you would like as you said that your parents encouraged you so uh, you were fortunate enough but not every child is so i would like you to just quote something to the parents who see these qualities in their children but uh, are not ready to accept it yeah i think uh, uh, i would say a big message to parents you know tap your kids inclinations as fast as possible unko confuse mat rakho they are quite genius in understanding what they are made for and rather be with them to understand what is their inclination towards us that's very important jitni jaldi uski inclination ko pakad loge wo bachcha utni jaldi excel karega for example like musician jo hota hai bachcha wo chhota sa hota hai 3 saal ka riyaz karna shuru kar deta hai एक कोई बहुत ही अच्छे परफॉर्मेंस लाइक भरतनाट्यम डांसर्स और कथक डांसर्स आई मीन दे स्टार्टेड यंग एट एज आई थिंक सेम थिंग विद आवर क्रिएटिव फील्ड्स लाइक डिजाइन एंड यू नो आर्किटेक्चर और अदर क्रिएटिव फील्ड्स इट शुड बी टैप एज सुन एज पॉसिबल सो माय अंबर रिक्वेस्ट टू पेरेंट्स इज दैट यू नो बी इन टच विद योर स्टूडेंट विद योर किड with their teachers try to understand and nurture what your kid is in it for it's extremely important get usko jitni jaldi wo space doge wo utna jaldi usme aage badhega and when the moment we start to put those gates and obstacles ki nahi tumne idhar jana hai udhar jana hai you know like we really ruin that natural talent in a child so my request to parents is that you know talk to them जस्ट बातों बातों में उनसे पता करो उनको क्या चीज अच्छी लगती है लाइक आई फ्यू डिजाइन स्टूडेंट्स हु नेवर वांटेड टू बी डिजाइनर्स बट वांटेड टू बी अ पायलट सो एंड आई हैव सीन यू नो किड्स ड्राइंग ओनली एरोप्लेन्स लाइक आई हैड दिस बॉय इन द क्लास हु ओनली ड्रू एरोप्लेन्स आई हैड टू रीच आउट टू हिज पेरेंट्स दैट प्लीज क्यों कर रहे हो इसके साथ डिजाइन बिकॉज़ दे हैड अ बिग सेटअप बिग एक्सपोर्ट हाउस सो दे वांटेड हिम टू बी a uh, designer further but then i think the boy was uh, they listen to him and is going to be a pilot further so it is extremely important that's one number two when you are asking about the skill of sketching you know bachche darte hain ki sketching nahi aati even parents bhi darte hain ki inhe sketching nahi aati to kaise designer banega i think that should not be the only skill that you are mapping your kid with uh wo kitni achhi tarah se soch sakta hai that's very important वो कितनी अच्छी तरह से लिख सकता है द एक्सप्रेशन शुड बी एक्सट्रीमली गुड देन दिस स्किल्स बिकॉज वो स्किल जब आप हमारे पास आएंगे हम सिखाएंगे आपको राइट आई वुड लाइक टू एड अप टू दैट बिकॉज व्हेन किड्स कम एंड आस्क अस कि ड्राइंग नहीं आती हाउ आर वी गोइंग टू प्रिपेयर फॉर दिस एग्जाम सो वी टेल देम द फैक्ट दैट यू रियलाइज दैट यू डोंट नो हाउ टू स्केच यू आर you have already taken first step that you are inclined towards it and you don't know and you want to learn for it right when we counsel them we tell them that this is the language of communication that you need to learn agar aapko koi cheez communicate karni hai aapka idea communicate karna hai to drawing is just the communication medium to do it so we are not yeah. looking out for fine art students we are looking mm-hmm. out for students who can uh, imagine well as you said yes. uh, who can innovate who has different unique ideas coming to their mind when it comes to a problem solving they can give uh, solutions to it so sirf drawing koi uh, mapdand nahi hai jisse hum bacche ko aak rahe hain and just rightly ma'am ne bataya ki uh, for these learnings only the colleges are there right so they are going to take care of your learnings and your uh, grooming for it but the first step that you need to take is to start brushing your uh, your skills your communication skills through the drawing medium i think more than that you know they need to read a lot yes they need to observe a lot yes sketching is a medium when they'll be expressing what they're thinking yes we're not saying that you shouldn't have done any sketching before or never held a pencil in your hand but yes when they're trying to be like the masters wo thoda sa gadbad ho jata hai you cannot be a master overnight you know it takes years of 
years of experience and riyas to be like them correct it is a art form it would require any art form be it music dance it will mm. require riyas and a consistent uh, practice to go to a higher level so that is what we are looking forward when you are around such kids day in day out ma'am what mm -hmm. kind of difference do you see in children from the time you come and uh, the present student who you are teaching right now so is there a difference of uh, in the learning curve in the way they understand things if you can share that with us can you can you please uh, repeat the question now that you are around the uh, students mm -hmm. day in day out what kind of change do you see in the students mindset today okay yeah okay so i think today's student is very lucky because there is plethora of information around them they have a smartphone in their hand they can do any they can google any information unke paas beantha information hai and i think it is a time you know they are standing at a time where they can actually use this loads of information and channelize the information they are they getting you know into a better outcome i mean you have been using word innovations so how do innovations happen like hamare time pe research karne ke liye hame libraries bhi dhoondni padti thi abhi inke paas sab kuch hai mobile phone ke upar right i think so it should be used in a very constructive way that you know they can gather a lot of ideas from there then start to checklist and edit that information which is there and what kind of outcome come is coming so outcome again is not just hitting in the dark so when they are with us we are teaching them the nuances of there is an industry there is a market type there is an age group there is a season that you are catering to to wo information jab itni sari hoti se channelize kaise karna that's what then we get into teaching them yes as you said these are the lucky ones because itna exposure shayad abhi ye इस जनरेशन को जो मिल रहा है वो पहले कभी नहीं था जितना अवेयरनेस इन बच्चों को आज है शायद हम उस एज में कभी उतने अवेयर ही नहीं थे लाइक यू सेड दैट एट योर एज व्हेन यू वर थिंकिंग ऑफ करियर यू एक्चुअली डिड नॉट नो दैट सच अ वर्ल्ड एग्जिस्ट सो ये इन लोगों के लिए इन एजेस के बच्चों के लिए बहुत ही पॉजिटिव चीज है दैट दे हैव टू एक्चुअली चैनलाइज देयर एनर्जीज एंड ड्रीम्स एंड गोल्स टूवर्ड्स द इन्फॉर्मेशन दैट दे हैव इन हैंड फॉर ऑल काइंड ऑफ इंडस्ट्रीज uh taking it forward so i think you know yeah. yeah it's just to add up like youtube is such a lovely channel like they have they can learn so many things if they are very focused there are thousands of chapters only on sketching i mean just to say that you know like they can really pick up so many things from there plus be with the physical teacher where they can help help them refine those skills taking this uh Uh, talk as example we, this is going uh, on the youtube channel we uh, are trying to get students such informative mm -hmm. and uh, knowledgeable things on our channel also so that these students stay connected with their uh, goals and they are uh, pushed towards aiming higher and higher uh, taking this forward ma'am i would like to ask you how the indian design industry is shaping up because we see that there is a lot lot of change in last decade uh, taking design industry as a whole we have heard that uh, design indian design policy also is going to be out by august 2023 so that encourage us to think beyond what we are seeing right now so i'm sure that this is shaping up in a good way i think the most promising thing which is happening at the moment is with the design industry india has woken up as being one of the fast growing young country yeah so then and, and the kind of policies which our governments has made so there is this whole space of startups which has come up you know so that's another where we get a lot of independence that okay you can be learn and be there you have to be creative and create be such a body that you are giving furthermore jobs to many people you know so there is this whole celebration of who we are right the the young minds which are really creative so unko ek space mil rahi hai pure back end pe jobs ho rahe hain jahan pe systems in place are if they are starting uh, a startup then who all are there the finances and the banks and other policies like everyone is getting stationed to help them to add more fuel to their dreams is one thing 
Number two, the world of our international brands are looking into us and they are coming and investing in our country. That's happening. Number three, we are a very rich country today in the entire world on craft. So my message to all the students would be wherever you live, wherever you are, please talk to your parents, read the local newspapers, find out in the vicinity what kind of crafts are there. I think uh, when you come to design schools, you know, our main focus is like when you're talking about ecosystems and circular economy as the future or in the present, which is already started as the big buzzword. So we are always telling, go back to your cities. There's so much. Tap that energy. So how would you be doing? So Right? And they take it as a round back again. So my request, your young minds, you have not been exposed to this world. Please see what kind of crafts are happening, which for sure you can encash in your future as a designer. You will be giving lives to so many people, working life to so many people who are in the back end. We'll be stopping. I mean, that's another role of a designer. We'll be stopping the migrations to Metro City. They'll be in the ecosystem. So, yes, are very playful. Okay, that's what India is all about. So, I think in today's time, the platform you all are, you are the ambassadors of the future India. You'll have to work very wisely and listen to, read and observe and get to know about all the finances, are there angel investors? And yes, sab cheeze abhi mare, uh, new education policy mein school ke andar hi aari. You know, even our schools are talking about entrepreneurship. Yes, yes. So if you have no friend in that subject, please be friends with them, understand business plans kaise bante, because a designer ko aakar ke sirf designing nahi karni, bohat sari cheeze hain karni, and there is a very serious role on a designer. Right? So not to be taken, that's just a fun uh, industry or mein ja ke malze karunga design pe. No. There is very serious work and you'll have to be seriously working on it, creating something where people can make use of it and then that was really a very good insight from the industry ma'am i would have taken a step ahead today to get into such a vibrant and itna uh, exposure wala stream agar mujhe milta to we would have been very lucky i'm sure this is going to really motivate and make student understand the uh, array of opportunities, limitless career opportunities in creative. Um, getting back to students again, once they have understood that this industry is really booming and they have, everyone will have a place in this because everything starts with designing, right? If, if we see anything around us is first design and then manufactured. So taking that as a learning today, uh, when today at the student level, he's thinking of getting into this industry. What should be his um, uh, startup point? Is mentoring required? Uh, should he be looking for guidance in this uh, to come into this industry? See, guru ke bina har adhura hai. So a mentor is extremely important. Just umar mein ye bachche hai, bhoat jaldi phisal jate hai in the know, It's so difficult to kind of stay concentrated and focused. A guide and a mentor would always uh, uh, guard your, you know, your purity of creativity. It's that important. Uh, will add to what you have been researching. They'll get you to know right kind of, uh, say, schools or uh, other avenues or other museums to visit to add up to your uh, knowledge. Uh, maybe they are reading more, they'll add up to your knowledge. You know, many ye article pada pisko parke de kiye. Because ye bache bi schools may have the ari karre boards exams ki are ke regular jo assignments of the rep. So I think ek essa mentor pakarna bohot zuri. I think I would uh, I would advise them to have it as soon as possible. And I think that kai bachon ke saath mein mentors bhi nahi, unki vicinity mein nahi hote hain, kahan jayein, kya kare. So we have online portals uh, through you people. They can stay in touch with uh, some great teachers who can be their mentors throughout. And um, 
they leave a lovely mark on them and uh, it should be a very open two-way process if the mentor is giving you something you're discussing i think uh, the ones who have it they're very lucky and my request to a student is never get conscious with a mentor you should be so open when you're discussing something Right? A difference, a teacher at mentor may both difference with that. And mentor is to guide you through every little step. So have a very transparent, yeah, have a very transparent dialogue with your mentor so that you, you are guided very well and you have no worries then if you are in hands of a good mentor. I really agree to this. When we mentor students at Creative Edge, we generally try and tell students that please blur out your ideas when it comes to your mind because Every time a brilliant idea first spoken is taken as an idiot idea, right? And Thank that you. only marks a, a, marks a space in the history, right? So, jo bhi ideas man mein hai, please try and share it, bounce it with your friends, your mentors, your teachers, because you never know when it clicks the right chord, right? Because uh, weird ideas sometimes work well and best in the industry. So, don't shy out. We can understand that Education industry, I think, uh, 12th ka bahut spoon fed education raha hai ka. So they have got into a habit of not talking too much. They are into their own shell, what has been taught, they learn, they mug up, they practice, they give the exams. But design is a totally different world where we uh, are supposed to talk. It is everything practical. It is nothing, nothing to be mugged up. When you go in colleges, you actually have to practically do most of the things and present it in front of the jury on or the faculties. So it is a brilliant thing to happen, right? Uh, now I would like to um, ask you, ma'am, that uh, when these students are planning, now that the awareness is there, that uh, they have to get into top colleges to give um, best examination call, uh, for these colleges like NID, NIFT or UC for IIT. Um, so there is a part of aptitude in it. So how, what do you feel that this aptitude um, will play a role in their grooming? Most of the students ask us, if the design ka test is aptitude, kyu pucha jata hai? because they sometimes fear math or they don't like calculations. So do you feel this aptitude part in the examination plays a role in it? Uh, well, it does play a very important role. Your creative aptitude is extremely of importance. Unfortunately, बहुत सारे बच्चे इतने conscious हो जाते हैं कि मेरे पास तो ये चीज़ है ही नहीं, right? I think everyone on this planet is very creative. And उसमें जब आपको question आ रहा है या आपको ideas देने हैं, solve करना है उसको, don't bother. Whatever is coming in your mind, naturally let it be out. Just throw it. वो आपका एक original idea, वो आपका है. आपने कहीं से चोरी करके नहीं दिया उस idea को. So one thing to have that confidence, yes, I am creative. Aap samjhe jag, aapka likhte likhte pencil toot gai, to aap kya karte ho usko? Aap creative solutions dhoonne lagte ho, usi time pe, on that spur of moment, kya chan, kya chiz dhoon, dousra pen dhoon ho gai, yeh chiz karo gai, phir kisi chiz se usko sharpen karne ki koshish karte ho, sharpener ni mil raha to chaku yu utha lete ho, you are, you know, trying to sharpen your pencil. So what are these things? These are your creative aptitudes only, you're trying to find a solution to a problem which has come in your life. Right? You're not giving up. You're not saying that, okay, I cannot write because my pencil broke off. Same thing. conscious You're not feeling that I'm in that judgmental situation. Problem kya jati jab bache ke hota ki I'll be judged because of my answer. There they start to try to be somebody else. So my request to you all, I mean, I've been through like so many students have passed in these last 20 years, 20 plus years of my academic thing. You have to be naturally you. Don't say that it was more than me, that I had done more than me. Please, this pressure to me, my request is to all say, for creative aptitude, leave it aside. You all are God's beautiful gifts to this planet. Make best use of it. And Regya, when we were talking about a mentor, when they connect mentor and student ka, with your creative aptitude, he will do his own work. He will see that you are good at what you are doing. How do you see it in the other world? And then that awakening happens. You know? So please... Uh, Give yourself. It's like you are, you say, you have to do it in your own way. You do it in your own way and then there is no end to your life ahead. 
you'll you'll bloom like anything right so my definition to creative aptitude is like this and i have been telling my students and i see the difference also the moment i say don't take stress on you to ye jo stress aa jata hai hamara social stress bahut hai hamara upar us cheez ko hata dijiye we get into unwanted competitions why i know the competition word is really good but don't don't start to uh, you know uh, अपने आप को दबाओ मत उस कॉन्फिडेंस में उस कंपटीशन में आप जो हो उसको दिखाओ फॉर एग्जांपल आपके इंग्लिश ऐसे आते हैं व्हेन यू आर राइटिंग इन एन एग्जाम ऑन द स्पॉट यू स्टार्ट टू राइट एंड आप कहानी लिखते हो ये सब करते हो ये सब यही क्या है वो क्रिएटिविटी तो है एंड देन यू सरप्राइज टीचर इज गिविन यू सेवन ऑन टेन इवन फाइव ऑन टेन इज कंसिडर्ड सो गुड राइट बिकॉज वो एकदम अंदर से बहाव भाव निकल रहे थे सो आई थिंक डोंट इग्नोर ऑल दीज थिंग्स योर योर एसे राइटिंग योर ग्रामर दे ऑल आर क्रिएटिव नुआंसिस विच आर टॉट टू यू वेन यू आर एक्सपूल सो आई रियली से ओट योर स्कूल टीचर्स हैव गिवन यू सो मेनी थिंग्स येस हमें इतना स्पेस नहीं मिलता है क्रिएटिव होने के लिए तो आप जब आ रहे हैं टेन प्लस टू के बाद आप तैयारी तो कर रहे हो तो वो जो डर लेके आते हो क्रिएटिव एप्टीट्यूड का उसको उसको और नर्चर करो उसे और पानी दो कि आपने आगे चल करके बहुत अच्छा करना है एंड व्हेन वी आर इन द कॉलेजेस वी आर वेटिंग फॉर स्टूडेंट्स लाइक यू ऑल टू कम टू अस राइट एक और बहुत कॉमन क्वेश्चन है मैम वेन द स्टूडेंट कम्स विद माइंड सेट दैट ही वॉन्ट्स टू गेट इन क्रिएटिव फील्ड बट इतने सारे डिफरेंट डिपार्टमेंट्स के बीच में नहीं डिफरेंशिएट uh, कर पाता कि मैं किस चीज में बहुत अच्छा होता हूँ डिजाइन uh, सुनते ही जैसे मोस्ट ऑफ द पेरेंट्स सोचते हैं कि फैशन इंटीरियर के बियॉन्ड कुछ नहीं है पर वैसे ही शायद कई बार मोस्ट ऑफ द स्टूडेंट्स आल्सो हैव दिस इन माइंड कि इसके बियॉन्ड क्या एंड वंस वी गिव दम दिस इन्फॉर्मेशन दिस इज अ क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम माई साइड ऑल्सो बिकॉज वी वेन काउंसिल स्टूडेंट दिस कम्स अप लॉर्ड ऑफ टाइम्स एंड I would also learn from your answer that this should be the right way to judge it. Now, uh, how to judge that a student is meant for a specific domain or a specific department? See, for this, um, the easy exercise is first ask yourself, who am I? I am who? 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 आज आर्किटेक्ट्स बड़े अच्छे कर रहे हैं चलो सब आर्किटेक्ट्स पक जाते हैं आज फैशन बड़ा अच्छा कर रहे हैं चलो आज सारे फैशन बन जाते हैं बट इट इज सो इम्पोर्टेंट टू आस्क योर सेल्फ क्वेश्चन यू हैव टू गिव दैट पॉज मुझे क्या चीज अच्छी लगती है मैं किस चीज की तरफ ज्यादा अट्रैक्टिवली आई मीन वॉट हिप्नोटाइज मी मैं को क्या चीज अट्रैक्शन अट्रैक्ट करती है मैं किन चीजों को इकट्ठा करना चाहता हूँ या करती हूँ हाउ डू यू थिंक एनी बडी वुड है even that's a creative industry somebody who is making such beautiful uh, you know dishes in the or they are becoming chef even that's a creative industry aur kitna you have to play with the tastes of people tum kaise uski zuban ke through uski taste ke through uske zaddo zehen mein utarte ho ki itna acha khana bana to ye cheeze apne aap mein karo and i'll request to all the students is to keep a journal you know that will be the easiest way you keep collecting pictures and keep relooking what is that my uh, i'm liking the most am i liking something which is furniture or am i liking something to do with interiors or textiles are attracting me or fashion is attracting me because you're bohot intimidating world you like you know you get into it and you like everything possible so start to see agar maine aaj 20 pictures collect kiye to maine kis cheez ko zyada collect kiya तो एक तरह की चेक लिस्टिंग यू नो जस्ट टॉक टू योर सेल्फ तो हम आर्ट ऑफ एडिटिंग होती है सो द वंस व्हिच आर नॉट लाइकिंग स्टार्ट टू रिमूव देम आई एम नॉट लाइकिंग देम दीस आर द वंस आई एम लाइकिंग व्हाट एम आई लाइकिंग अबाउट इट इज इट अट्रैक्टिंग यू टू रीड अबाउट इट मोर क्या आप जानना चाहते हो कि इसके डिजाइनर्स कौन है लाइक फैशन डिजाइनर में हर कोई जानना चाहता है कि हां 10 फैशन डिजाइनर्स के नाम हमें पता है मीडिया भी बहुत कुछ दिखाती है बट यस आर्किटेक्ट्स इतना नहीं बात करती या फिर ऑटोमोबाइल डिजाइनर्स कितने के बारे में बात होती देर आर स्टूडेंट्स हु आर अट्रैक्टेड टूवर्ड्स दिस आल्सो राइट वी हैव वी एक्स एवरीथिंग व्हिच इज कमिंग अप सो फर्स्ट थिंग वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट यू शुड नो व्हाट काइंड ऑफ डिसिप्लिनस एग्जिस्ट अंडर द डिजाइन अम्ब्रेला देन रीड व्हाट आर दे गोइंग टू टीच एंड व्हेन यू गेट इनटू द डिजाइन स्कूल्स डज दैट एक्साइट यू 
you know, will that give you some kind of excitement? That is very important. Like a uh, school may sat subjects hote hai, agar hume history ni achhi lagti to hum kehte hai, bore ho jayenge aaj. So automatically history is away from you. Somebody likes chemistry will be so attracted towards to be there regularly in that class. So see where is a repetitive, you know, pattern getting formed. So that will help them to understand that yes, I know about this stream. So when when these students come to us for interviews, what are we asking? Do you know the names of architects? Can you name three architects? Can you name three fashion designers' names? Or automobiles ki baat hori, aapko teen best latest cars pata hai ki kya hai hai. So this is again awareness. You know, so if you are getting attracted towards any particular discipline, be aware, read about it, and be uh, so passionate that we also know kis bachche ko to maza hi aayega padha. Right? Really open up my mind also how to counsel students for their department now. Uh, I hope students have got a lot of insights about uh, how to prepare and uh, what to think ab about while preparing, how to plan, set your goal and um, try and achieve it. Um, you coming from top schools, design schools and teaching there for so long, uh, these two students are also curious to know their life in a design school because generally uh, till now they have only in their school life where everything is very uh, structured from 15 years they've been doing same thing getting into a bus going to school assemblies and classes so does this work like uh, the same in a design school or it is something different another question that students come up with is um, uh, is it a very difficult uh, structure to follow in college okay um, very good questions both of them so when they come from school to a design school, one core thing very important which you would like is discipline, right? A discipline kisi ko acha nahi lagta hai, but bahut zaroori hota hai. And when you are a professional, it is all the more important. So it is a uh, kind of an impression that design schools mein jao, kuch bhi kar loge, kaise bhi ho jao. I mean how uh, these streams are taken in our country, like design and art is like it's too frivolous. Jo kuch nahi kar saka yahan chala gaya, but no. And we've seen the students who have been to the core disciplined are the winners. They have become big names in the industry. They have sustained their brand in the industry. And that wouldn't have happened without proper time management and discipline. Right? So when you step in into a design school, you have a foundation here. So you are part of it. And that foundation is basically that, you know, we've been into a structured system of learning. So how do you come and start to unlearn certain things? How do you start to see that, you know, there are no such uh, taboos or pressures, but yes, I am now getting into the new world. I'm understanding about the new environment. So it's a whole ecosystem that you gradually design ke mein information dena shuru kar So you are now not in that that I notes to make notes. Yeah, spoon feeding hoga. So a design school does a lot with you have to have that self motivation, right? You've come here to learn, which is not that okay. Me, uh, ke lectures de jaunga, aapko ya notes de diya, you'll mug it up and throw it out. As we began this entire talk, like you know, there are juries, there are no written papers. So for this, you will have to be on your toes from morning till evening. Not banking only upon teachers ki hum eko teacher hi sab kuch ghot ghot ke pilayenge. No, we have beautiful libraries. Go make use of it. So a design, a good designer is to do a lot with good research. So we start to induce research as a very strong attribute in a design. Aaj jitne bhi bade designers hain, unka research database itna strong hai, tabhi wo itne bade designers hain. So if anybody is thinking, oh, generally bachche mein hota hai, kya re usko to your research has to be really strong. And then there is no looking back because you'll have a reasoning for everything. You can convince people. So we induce a lot of uh, research driven um, learning in a, in a design school. You have uh, internal juries, external juries. You, you have to pass through all these you know, uh, makeshift uh, industry environments that we create so that uh, you you can face and defend your case 
So it's like a lot of talking as we were talking about communication. So you have to have that gift of gab. You start to learn. And we've seen bachche jo starting mein bolni baat and by the end of the years, you know, like when they're third and fourth year, they can literally defend their case very well. So that's something that we are inducing. Then there is, uh, there are assignments which are very creative. So you immerse in them. So there's something called as body, mind, and soul uh, integration and alignment. So uh, we try to teach them that, you know, in sub chizo ke itne integrity se rakho ki aap pure ke pure summer jo reo learning ke andar. So none of your uh, faculty should be kept aside. So the entire body and your soul is part of learning. So our curriculum and our subjects are designed that way. Uh, then you have to have your portfolios done. That's very important. So every semester and you have to uh, create a, and, uh, you know, document your work that you've done. So by the time you're in a final year, you would have the entire journey documented well. We, we teach you such skills that you refine. So representation is very important. Then when you're getting into industry, you're not taking your, uh, you know, initial scribbles to them. So how would you document and uh, uh, present your work? So that presentation is very important. So we also learn how to play with the children and how to refine yourself, how to formally present yourself to the industry, even that is so that's how it is. Besides this, we have a lot of clubs. You have um, the entire cultural society at WUD. We have cult, which is very well established, all run by the students. So it's a very good learning base because at times if you're too shy and you cannot do something, get into all those things. So it's mandatory on the campus to be part of various clubs. So we have seen, you know, uh, students really blooming through those co-curricular activities. Sounds so exciting to me. Because um, otherwise, when stu students are going into uh, theoretical courses, very um, old school courses like BCom, BCA, BBS, or for that matter, even BE, uh, lesser practical exposure is given. More of theoretical knowledge has been imparted in these courses. But uh, listening to all this, I really feel that the students will have a very extensive learning course where most of the things they are doing are really practical. Because in today's industry, when we see that uh, old courses or um, theoretical courses are not doing well in the industry. The reason being, we are not able to bridge the gap between the implementation of knowledge and gaining the knowledge. I see uh, a design program is bridging it very nicely, very smoothly, and uh, top colleges are really doing the best yeah. for it. And yeah. faculties like you, ma'am, really are uh, shaping the career for these kids. And I'm really glad to have you today on this Thank platform you. and uh, it was really insightful and uh, gaining knowledge uh, stream to for us and i'm sure for all of our students on this channel today to uh, get the exposure and um, information about the industry so well Thank you. Thank you very much, ma'am. I would like to uh, tell you all students that these kind of informative uh, videos keep on coming on our channel. So do subscribe if you have not subscribed that channel and we will be happy to give you more such uh, information through our channels. Thank you very much. Thank you and wishing all the students the very best of the future. Thank, Thank you. you very much. Thank you from uh, Creative Edge and Top Rankers family, ma'am.